this is Brenda from the Beaverton City Library and today we are going to be making an at-home sensory toy together. So there are actually a ton of DIY fidget toys that you can make with common household items and I'm going to show you how to make one today and it's really cool. This is a fidget flower and it really only has like two supplies that you need plus some scissors so we are going to make this together today so let's not waste any more time let's get right to it all right so the first thing we're going to do is decorate our toilet paper roll so i already started but what you're going to do is take duct tape and you are going to wrap it around until you can't see any of the brown anymore if you don't have any duct tape what you can do is decorate with crayons or markers whatever you'd like until it looks how you want it and I'm just like pre-cutting pieces, but if you want, you can just wrap it around straight from the roll. I'm just going to finish this up to where I like it, just so that there's no brown. You don't have to wrap it around multiple times, just as much as you like, because we are going to cut through this. Once you've got it all decorated, now what we're going to do is squish it up so it's flat. That's good, just so it's easier for cutting. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut six little sections out of it. So for the first one, I'm gonna do an inch or so and then you can use that one as your guide and keep on cutting until you have all your pieces so once you're done cutting you should have one two three four five six petals and they look like this and before we tape them together we're going to fold them both ways here so that they start to have a little diamond shape So I have my for my original fold and I'm just going to fold them in half the other way. So then we have our diamonds. Now we have all of our folded diamonds. I wanted to show you basically the arrangement that we're going to tape them together in. So in the end, they're going to look like this, except they're not going to be attached at the very bottom. Now let's start taping them together. So you're going to take your first diamond. And what we're going to be doing is attaching them just on their bottom layers. So we're going to do that. If you have scotch tape, you can use scotch tape for this. I'm just going to use my duct tape. So what I'm going to do is take my scissors and cut just some really small strips out of my duct tape. You're going to want little strips like this. And we're going to combine them at their bases. So just wrapping around like that. All right, so those were the first two. So I just wanted to show you how we go along. So now we're gonna do just in the same bottoms all the way around so we start to get that shape. And we'll keep on going, but when we get to the end, we're not gonna attach the last two together. So when you're all done, this is what it should look like. So there you have it. That is how we make our DIY sensory toy, our fidget flower. Pretty cool. Um, if you're looking for more DIY uh, at home fidget toy ideas, there is a YouTube channel called Imagination Magic that has a ton of really cool ones with really simple supplies. So I recommend you check them out. All right, have a good day. Bye.